Our lives have completely changed in history after the establishment of factories. Thanks to factories, we could do mass production in a quick and accurate manner. Today on KBiz, we learn more about a company that makes special components which upgrade the facilities at factories. Hi everyone, I'm your host Henry and welcome to another episode of KBiz. Now today, I'm at a factory and not at an office. But what pops into your mind when I say factory? These days factories don't need a lot of workers like they did in the past because most of the machines are automated. So today's enterprise is one that makes products needed for automation. Let's go and find out more about this company. I was always in awe when the machines can move by themselves. Oh, really? The machines are busy working in the factory. What are they making? Wow! Now this factory is huge. What do you do here, Mr. Park? We See, I think I got it. No, not really. What does it mean? 우리 공장을 보시면서 제가 자세히 설명해 드리겠습니다. 아, I see, I see. 네. 한번 보시겠습니까? 예, 예. 예. <웃음> This factory mainly manufactures the key components installed in machines. It makes hydraulic and pneumatic cylinders. Hydraulic cylinders use power by compressing oil and it is a component that controls the machine. Four cranes or excavators and tower cranes need a lot of power so these cylinders are used on construction equipment. Pneumatic cylinders use power by compressing the air and it is also used to control the machines. The robot arm machine needs detailed movement rather than strength. It is mainly used in machines used to make semiconductors. Hydraulic and pneumatic cylinders. I think I get it now. But out of the two, which one is more important? But if we had to choose, which one is more important for the future? Why? This is the pneumatic solenoid valve made by this company. It controls the direction and the flow of the compressed air. It operates powered machineries and is a necessary component used in automation equipment. But there is something special in the pneumatic valves made by this company. In addition, this company manufactures pneumatic cylinders, hydraulic cylinders, cleaners, and other diverse components for automation equipment. Thanks to such technical abilities, this company delivers to Korean conglomerate corporations and also exports to 28 countries. Last year, it made profits of 30 million US dollars. In 2019, there was an export restriction where core materials for making semiconductors could not be exported to Korea and to Japan. Since then, industrial materials were no longer dependent on imports, and more and more companies stated that key components must be localized. It is because industries and the economy must not endure heavy losses due to diplomatic issues. Now, the CEO of today's company pays a huge and significant importance to localization. This is the production line using pneumatic pressure. 
Every single part of the system is important, but the most crucial part is the control apparatus that controls the air. Air clean units are used on this control apparatus. This component was recently developed by this company and it is very significant. Why is it significant? So we heard that you developed this component recently. So why did you develop it? Why is it important to localize all the components? 소재 부품 장비 산업, 즉 소부장 산업이 튼튼해야 국가 기관 산업이 외국 기업이 흔들리지 않습니다. 최근 일본이 반도체 산업 관련해서 대한민국을 위협한 사례는 소부장 산업에 취약한 우리의 약점이 드러난 것이라고 볼수 있습니다. 소부장 산업은 하루 아침에 이루어지지도 않고 10년, 20년 걸려도 선진국을 따라잡기 어려운 산업입니다. 저희 KCC 전공은 소부장 산업의 독립을 이끈다는 자부심을 가지고 유공합 시린다와 별부류 개발로 개발 보급에 몰두하고 있습니다. What is the most important thing for a company to succeed? Special technology, a good business model, or maybe hardworking employees? Well, all of the above mentioned things are really important, but this company today has a really special element. Its CEO's perseverance that has helped the company to stay strong for almost three decades. And as always, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time on KBiz.